Wednesday evening, um, our After Hours Emergency Animal Protection Officer received a call from a member of the public who indicated that there was a cat in distress in their, in their area. It was in the northwest area of Regina. They found a cat that had its legs individually bound very tightly with uh, black electrical tape. The cat was rushed to the shelter and, and hours later um, received emergency veterinary treatment to remove um, the tape uh, and treat the damage to the limbs. Because the tape had been on for a significant amount of time, um, the circulation had caused um, all of the tissue uh, below the tape to die and, and become infected. So at that point, uh, our veterinary team was trying desperately to see if they can save uh, his limbs. We've seen some improvement, but um, unfortunately with, we're thinking that amputation may be necessary. We're going to leave it for the weekend and see how he does, but certainly that's a possibility. We're uh, committed to Bruce, and really we believe he deserves an opportunity to um, feel safe and love after this purposeful act of, of animal cruelty. When it, my, our officers picked him up, um, they literally, when, when they lifted him into their arms, he literally collapsed. I, I think that it had been a, a, a tremendous struggle for him. And at that moment when he collapsed in their arms and, you know, he knew he was safe. And that's when they named him Bruce Almighty because they knew that, uh, you know, he had a lot of fight in, in him. And, and just when he arrived at our shelter is when he knew uh, he was safe and, and he could quit fighting and, and we could start fighting for him.